Now, residents and businesses are counting the cost of the huge floods which hit large areas of Scotland over the weekend. Farmers say they suffered major crop losses in the unprecedented heavy rainfall. Landslides caused disruption to roads and rail services. And a 77-year-old man is feared to have been swept away in the River Tay. The flooding also caused problems further south with a listed building collapsing in Cockermouth. Kelly Foran reports. Here we are. This is the road. And that was the road. Towns cut off due to landslides. Windscreen wipers can do little when there's this much rainfall. From roads to rail, flooded. The search is still on for a 77-year-old man fears he's been swept away by the River Tay. And farmers here say they've suffered some of the biggest losses in food crops the industry has ever seen. We've seen flooding in this area before and you expect it later on in the year where there's snow melt um, through the winter months, but not as early as this, certainly not in my lifetime. It was at this level yesterday. Lorna's coming to terms with how her home of 23 years has been left after unprecedented downpours, not helped by a delay in the local council closing the floodgates. I'm feeling a little bit upset now. You don't need experts to tell you, you just have to look out the window to see what the weather's like. So I, I'm, I don't know how they're going to explain this. Flooding caused this building in Cumbria to be closed back in 2021. It's now started crumbling into the river and some fear that more bad weather could cause it to collapse further, meaning water levels in this town would rise. We're just waiting to see what happens. I mean, there's a lot more building to come down yet. It's, the, the roof's dangerously hanging over and we just, we just want to, to get it sorted as soon as possible, really. They may not have much time with more rain forecast in the coming days, though it's hoped there won't be a repeat of what happened at the weekend. Kelly Foran, ITV News.